This is BMAC here for podcast 152. Subscribe, guys, subscribe. I went to an amazing, hist- well, yeah, historic event last weekend. That be, I should say. It was a freedom rally. Uh, the Boston Broadside had a rally, sponsored it. They had Jeff Cooner from RKO, who I'm going to have on pretty soon actually on the show, actually. Um, he spoke. And Jeff Deal, who ran for governor against Baker, believe it or not, spoke. It was at 1 p.m. I sang two songs, a national anthem, and then I ended the event with God Bless the USA. That was a closer for the event. And Jeff Coon is completely right. This is a launch of a new civil rights movement in the circumstances where, because, you know, if you don't want the vaccine, you have to get it. You know what I'm saying? I'm just going to look at it that way. But no, I, it was a wonderful event. And Cooner, thank you for letting me sing, Jeff Cooner, for that much in a couple of weeks. Um, allowed to be on October 20th at 10.30. Special interview. First, first really big interview that I've had in a long time. It'll be a big one. Um, he's from Canada. He's worked for the Washington Times, right? Article for the Washington Times. And he's a political historian slash was also a professor at a university at one point too, taught history. So he's a pretty interesting guy. He's got two kids, Ashton and Ava, and a wife named Grace. They call her Dr. Grace. Um, they live, he lives in Rentham. And he's very outspoken. And he's on the same viewpoints as I have, same side as I have. Um, and he's really, he's, he speaks the truth, let's put it that way. He speaks loud and he speaks the truth. And that's why I have a vast respect for him. And they get to my friend Jim Wise. Hey, Jim, what's up, man? I see, I feel like I see Jim every single week now, almost practically. Um, and Bernadette, hey, Bernadette, what's up? Um, it was fun to see you guys once again. Always just fun to see you guys, no matter where we're at. Always good to talk to you and hang around. And um, yes, it was a absolute blast doing that, that rally. And I got to speak out a little bit too, sort of a little bit too. That was really, really fun. Now, I did some Trump points too at the at the event actually, um, and uh, that was a lot of fun to do too. I got the crowd going, so hey, if I did that, I feel like I did a good job at the end of the day. So, anyway, guys, this is podcast one five. Two, I'll see you guys tomorrow for podcast one, five, three.